Hi, my name is Scott Brown, president of Metastock. Congratulations on your purchase of Metastock. Metastock has been around for over 30 years and is one of the most advanced technical analysis software packages. I encourage you to use it. And if you run into any issues, please contact our world-class support team. Thanks and happy trading. In this video, I'm going to show you how to access your purchase of Zenith and Metastock and how to set up your account on Metastock.com. When you purchase Metastock, you'll receive two emails from us. You'll receive a welcome email and an order confirmation. So let's log in to email. And you'll see the welcome email as well as the order confirmation. So we're going to work out of the welcome email. And we're going to click on this link here that says log into your My Downloads page. So this is the first step in setting up your account on metastock.com. If you've purchased from us before, you've probably already set up this account. But if you haven't, then we need to do that now. So let's enter in the email address. And I'm going to select no, that I haven't registered with metastock.com. And this is the first step with setting up that account on metastock.com, which is where you will access all of your purchases, um, including Zenith and Metastock. So this basically says that we need to create our password for this account. And it's going to send us another email. So we're going to go back to email, go back to our inbox. And you now have a Metastock client communication email. And this is going to let us set up our password for our metastock.com account. And let's click on the set your password now. And let's create our password. And what this does is it automatically logs us into our My Downloads and our account on Metastock.com. And as you can see, in our My Downloads page, you're going to have access to all of your purchases from Metastock. And the first step to accessing your Zenith and your Metastock product is to sign the Metastock user agreement. Now, after you've signed the Metastock Users Agreement, you want to allow at least 60 minutes before you proceed to step two. So let's go ahead and complete step one and sign the Metastock Users Agreement. You just want to review the details of the agreement. And then you can scroll all the way down to the bottom. and click on accept and continue. And next, we're going to complete the first time login process. This is where you're going to set up the password for your Zenith and Metastock product. Now this is a separate password from your metastock.com account. A lot of times um, clients will use the same password just so that it's easy to keep track of things, but it's up to you to set whatever password you'd like. So let's go ahead and do that now. So let's create our password. And as you can see, it needs to be at least eight characters long and contain a mixture of upper and lower case letters and numbers. And let's select next. And select start. And here you'll want to choose a job function. You just want to select whatever makes the most sense. It may not apply directly, but let's select a couple of items here. And hit next. And let's do the same for choose asset classes. 
I'm just going to select everything. And then I'm going to select Add All Global Focus. And we'll select Next. And then we're just going to confirm our primary focus, make sure everything looks right as far as what we selected in the previous screens. And we'll hit Finish. And finally, we have the software license agreement. And select Accept. Next, we're just going to select um, our download location. I'll just select the United States. And then here's where we're going to download the Zenith installation package. Now that the install package is complete, we can begin the install of Zenith. I'm just going to drag the install onto my desktop and we can get started with the install of Zenith and then Metastock. So I'll just minimize my browser. So let's start the install. We're going to double click onto the file. Let's hit run. And now that Metastock Zenith is installed, let's start the product. You install Metastock Pro from within Metastock Zenith. So let's do that now. We're going to click onto the Helio. We're going to go to Help, About Thomson Reuters icon, and click on Add-ons. And for this demonstration, we're going to select the most current version of Metastock, which is Metastock Pro Retail Add-on for Zenith version 14 and select Install Add-on. Now that our install of Metastock Pro is complete, we need to restart Zenith to activate it. So let's do that. And now that Zenith has restarted, you can see that Metastock will come up in your Start menu. And let's launch Metastock. And if you've had previous versions of Metastock before, the Metastock Migration Utility will run upon your first startup. And you can either choose to run that now or choose to run it later. And I'm going to go ahead and select to run it later, but you will want to run the migration utility so that it can import all of your custom items like formulas and charts. And this concludes our video on how to access your and install your purchase of Metastock Zenith and Metastock Pro. Thank you for being our valued customer and happy trading.